Location 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 presenter Kirsty Alsop has responded to parents who took issue with her views as she branded the overuse of digital devices damaging. Kirsty Alsop has sparked a debate after claiming that smartphones damage young people and slam parents who allow the overuse of digital devices. The presenter, who has two sons with her husband Ben Anderson, said she is proud that her children have had broken bones over the years as it shows she had let them explore and take risks. She went on to say in a tweet, We now know the damage done by smartphones risk averse parenting. We have to make the changes necessary in society before it is too late at John Height. Kirsty shared her thoughts after discovering author Jonathan Height's new book, The Anxious Generation. The social psychologist argues that the decline of free play in children in childhood and the rise of smartphone usage among adolescents are the twin sources of increased mental distress among teenagers. According to statistics, 28% of 7-year-olds in the UK have smartphones and the ownership rises from 44 to 91% between those aged 9 and 11. Kirsty, 52, said such figures are totally insane as she stressed the importance of children's mental health and how parents should be more aware of the impact. She added, One of the saddest sights is a child sitting in a pram with pastel-colored iPad in a case which attaches to the pram. So you know it's theirs they are often on it. Yesterday a little girl walked past me on our road. No more than seven. She was glued to what was clearly her phone. The mother of two additionally wrote, There are a 1,000 reason to allow our children smartphones. But now that we have the data, we cannot go on pretending that it will be okay. It won't. Kirsty's opinion sparked many to challenge her views as one wrote. Agreed. One caveat here. As it is going to impact us in a few months, if your child takes public transport to go school or walk to school on their own, having a mobile provides peace of mind. That aside, the stats are quite shocking. Hitting back, she commented, Did you have a mobile when you went on the bus? The thought of a bus full of kids on phones not chatting to each other is so sad. Parents' desire for peace of mind has put our kids at risk. 